Hi everyone, it's Adam Sem Fish Tanks and in today's video I'm going to give you the 5 reasons on why fish keeping is the best hobby. So let's get into this. So number one for me has to be it's really relaxing. It's good for your mental health too and you know since I've started keeping fish when I've been stressed out and I've had a long day at work I'll come home and I'll spend maybe half an hour to an hour just sitting there watching the tank and uh, occupying myself with it. When it's down to maybe, you know, doing maintenance, uh, doing plant trimming, or just cleaning the glass in general, these kind of things in the hobby are the things that make the hobby. And for me, that's one of the main reasons why I just love fish keeping. It just makes me really relaxed. It de-stresses me and keeps me occupied. So that's my first reason. Reason number two that this is the best hobby is the fact that you're always learning. For me, I started around five years ago now, and honestly, uh, there's not a day that goes by that I'm not learning something new, whether that's through information and my friends in the community, or something that I've researched myself. There's always something to learn. You may know the basics, you may think that you know everything, but then there'll always be something that you won't know, and that for me is the pride and joy of being a part of this hobby, is always being open to learn new information and that's what i really love about it honestly reason number three for me is the fact that there's not just one kind of fish that you can keep there's so many and there's so many different types and species that you can discover or learn about whether that's research through online or if you go into a different fish shop or maybe if your local fish store ends up importing some new type of fish and that for me is the joy about it. I've been keeping fish for five years as I've stated previously, but in my tank there's a lot of fish that not many people would see and that's down to the fact that I've been doing this for so long now that I've decided to keep rarer type of fish that, not, that aren't so common in the hobby and um, that's purely the enjoyment that I get out of it is always finding new fish to keep or to research or to look at or recommend to my friends to keep because they'll walk into a shop and see you know the basic goldfish or mollies or swordtails or neon tetra when you you know there's so much more to see that's available in this hobby so that's my third reason reason number four for me is that it can be low effort too you can set up a tank that can be self-sustaining Obviously, different setups require a lot more maintenance than others, but for me, I have the pure enjoyment in my setup of having it being kind of self-sustaining. I have live plants in there, I have um, a good filter too, so the maintenance isn't as frequent as you probably have on like a smaller tank. Um, you know, when you've got live plants, it like, like recycles back around into the, the ecosystem itself, basically. So when the fish poop, or there's like leftover food or waste the plants will absorb that and reproduce and grow taller or bushier and that's just amazing to me the fact that like you can basically set up this you know little ecosystem and it's just looking after itself and you know as i stated the main reason being low effort is the fact that you've got other pets where you've always got to be present like for fish you could leave them for a day or two and they should be fine Obviously, you know, when you first set up the tank, it's it's a high maintenance thing, but once it's all settled, it can be very low effort. And again, that just really leads into one of my earlier points and the fact that it's just relaxing because you're not having to stress about it. So that's my fourth reason. Number five for me is the fact that this hobby is always evolving. As I've stated previously, I've been in the hobby for like five years now, and the setup now is probably the best setup I've had, but I've had you know the same tank before this for like a long period of time but i always made sure to have it evolving in some way whether that was changing the aquascape whether that was adding new plants or whether that was adding new fish and it's got potential to always be evolving and you don't need to stick to the one tank obviously that's my situation but you know there's so many different types of setups that you can create from this and um, whether that's new tanks or whether that's um with the information that you've learned from someone or, or what you've researched yourself. So that's the pure joy that I get out of this. So 
number five. So yeah, that's um, my top five reasons on why fish keeping is the best hobby. In my opinion, you know, there is a lot more reasons, but if I had to narrow it down, it'd, it'd be down to them five points, of course. And, you know, at the end of the day, um, as I said, this is my hobby and it's it's always been a thing that's been present now since I got into it. I don't think I can leave it now and I fell in love with it and I hope you fall in love with it too. Hoping that, you know, these points have got across and maybe make you consider if you haven't already to set up a fish tank or, you know, to maybe do some research and get into fish keeping. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe. We're we're not so far off a thousand now, it's, it's very close and um, the period of time that it's taken to get a thousand has been so quick and I'm so excited for what we'll be able to achieve with this channel but yeah, I'll see you guys later and girls, take it easy, see you later, peace.